Earlier tonight, armed guards picked up $1 million in cash from a secret vault. It was transported under maximum security to our protected set, where the entire million will be handed over to one couple. Their challenge? Hang on to it through the most heart-pounding game ever imagined. I'm Kevin Pollack, and this is the Million Dollar Money Drop. dollars in cash would look like wonder no more 50 bundles $20 bills each bundle $20,000 you ready to meet America's newest millionaires please welcome Mandy and Sergeant David Engelberg bring it in tell us a little about yourself I'm a Marine Recon Sergeant. My name's David. Uh, <laughs> uh, I met David at his welcome back from Iraq party, and uh, we dated for uh, three months, and we were married, and now we have two beautiful children. Aww. We miss Daddy when he goes away. Oh, well, we can't thank you enough for your thank service. You. Honest to God, thank you so much. Well, this million dollars is now yours. Oh, yeah! Come on over welcome and take a look. Baby. <laughs> Now, I must tell you, in order to keep it, you've got to give me the correct answers to seven multiple choice questions, all right? These four drops represent four possible answers to these questions, only one of which will be the correct answer. The rules are very simple, all right? You've got to risk all of your money on every single question. But if you're not certain about what the answer is, you can play it safe and place your money on more than one drop, all right? However, you must always leave one drop clear. Put your money on the wrong answer, and it drops. It's gone forever. <laughs> Whatever money you have left over after seven questions is yours to keep. You've yeah. got a million dollars. I've yeah. got seven questions. Let's play the million dollar yeah. money drop. All right? Yeah. All right. Let's take a look at categories for question number one. Add slogans, music. Let's talk it over. That's a We're pretty good at music because our kids love to sing along to music in the car. Right, yeah, music. 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 All right. Four possible answers are A, so, so B, so. fa, fa, C, fa. La, 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 and D, la, 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 la. T. Okay. Once you see the question, you'll be able to talk about it, and then we'll give you 60 seconds to put all your money down. Let's take a look at okay. the question. Of these four syllables in the song Do Re Mi, which represents the higher tone on the musical scale? Okay. Do, Re, of Mi, these four so syllables in the huh? song Do Re uh. Mi, which represents the higher tone in do, the musical do, scale? Do Re Mi Fa So La Ti. Do So do. Re Mi. Do Re Mi. It's Do Re Mi Fa So La Ti. Do. So Do Re Mi yeah, well, T, Fa So La Ti. Yeah, it's the last one. La Ti. That's the last one. T. It's Let's definitely go. T. Definitely. 45 it's, seconds. Sorry, babe. Do, re, fa, so, la, ti. Oh, my gosh. Do. This is so much money. <laughs> that is so hard. 35 seconds. Oh Work my together. God. There you go. There you go. Uh -oh. <laughs> Make sure it's all on there. Come on, babe. All right. Toss some money around. Oh, no, 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 babe. We got to stack yeah, it. Quick, yeah. Stack Work it to together. another ball. You got 20 seconds. It's all, it's all right. right it all goes right here. <laughs> Do, re, mi, fa, so, la, ti, do. And Careful, Andy. There. Andy, the last Andy, one. Andy. Oh, my God. All Thank right. you so much. I love you forever. Whoa, I owe you 20000 Oh, my God. Hey. First of all, I think we learned how hard it is to move around a million dollars in Ridiculous, cash. Ridiculous, but I'll do it every day right. if you want me to. Okay, the entire million dollars is on T. T has to be it. There's no question. Okay, so there's no, there's no doubt in your mind. However, one time in the first six questions, you get an opportunity to change your mind. We call this the quick change. When you ask for it, we'll give you an additional 30 seconds to move your money. But remember. You can use quick change only once and only in the first six questions. All right, do you want 
your quick change opportunity. No, baby. No, we're no. good. No. You're good? We're yeah, good. Baby. All right. Good. Then let's step up and see what drops. Oh, my God. One million dollars. That's all yours as of this moment. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. <laughs> and let's see. Let's drop. Let's do it. <laughs> oh my god. Like go ahead first. Oh my god. Tristan are going to help move your money back into position so we can, can continue the game. Those, they will be very, very careful with yeah. your million dollars. That is still yours after the first question. All right? Thank you very much. All right, check. Let's take a look at the categories for question number two. Parades, coins. coins. Talk it over. Parades and coins. coins. Let's go coins. We gotta go coins. Yeah. Let's do coins. Yeah. All right, coins. Go with coins. Let's take a look at the four possible answers. They are A. John F. Kennedy, B, Thomas Jefferson, C, Abraham Lincoln, and D, Franklin Roosevelt. And the question is, what U.S. president is on the dime? Talk it over. Oh, it's not Kennedy. Yes, it may be Kennedy. Thomas Jefferson, it may be Thomas Jefferson. I'm pretty sure it's Thomas Jefferson because nickel. Abraham Lincoln and Tom Jefferson. John Kennedy doesn't have a coin. John yes, he Kennedy does. It's doesn't a 50 cent piece. Have a, well, then it's a 50 cent piece. It's not the dime. The dime. 60 because seconds. Abraham Lincoln Clock is, is on moving. The nickel. Franklin Roosevelt doesn't have one unless it's a commemorative one. And John F. Kennedy. Thomas okay, Jefferson. you said 50 Thomas cents. You know, 100% it's Thomas Jefferson because I actually looked at one 50 seconds. when I was sweeping up after Lily playing with her piggy bank. <laughs> That's my Kramer. <laughs> there we go, baby. Oh, oh, shoot. oh, don't lose any. 100%. Thomas Jefferson. 35 seconds. Do you want to hedge it off a little bit on Kennedy? No, because Kennedy? Abe Lincoln, we know, is on the five. You said that's on the 50 cent piece. Franklin Roosevelt is only no, on like remember some commemorative. No. Roosevelt. Franklin 100% Thomas Jefferson. Don't question yourself because your first answer is always right. Always right. All right. 20 seconds. No. You don't need the clock. JFK. No, I don't need the clock. On the nickel. Abraham Lincoln is no. on the nickel. Lincoln's on the penny. No, Abraham Lincoln is on the nickel. Thomas oh, Jefferson penny. is on. Dime. No, Lincoln's on the penny. I guarantee Thomas that. Thomas Jefferson's on the dime. All right. Thomas Jefferson's on the dime. Thomas Five cents on the dime. All right. You know what? If you'd like, if you'd like the quick change, an opportunity to move some money around, I'll give you some more time. No, no, we don't need it because We're good. Washington We're good. and Lincoln are on okay. the way. Okay. He's scared, but we are good. Right. Again. What U.S. president is on the dime? A, John F. Kennedy, where you have no money. B, Thomas Jefferson, where there's one million dollars. C, Abraham Lincoln, no money. And D, Franklin Roosevelt, no money. The entire million, once again, on one answer. You pass on your quick change opportunity, so it's time to step up and see what drops. I gotta stand next to my money this time, baby. All right. They worked it out. They went down the list. We're good to go. One million dollars on Thomas Jefferson. Are you ready? Yeah, we're ready. It's we're an ready. all or nothing situation. Oh my God. If it's Thomas Jefferson, with all your certainty and boldness, you've taken one million dollars and blown right through the first two questions. If not, we're done. Oh my goodness gracious. Good luck. <laughs> Roosevelt's on the dime. It's far too brutal. Far too brutal. We can't thank you both enough. David, for your service, yeah, no, honest to God. Thank you so much. Sorry. So sorry. Let's hear it for him. All right? Oh, so brutal. Mandy and Sergeant David could not do it. They could not stop the drop tonight. They lost their million dollars. But we've got another couple. Please welcome.
Lana McKissick and Nathan Moore. Welcome, welcome. Nice to meet you both. Hi, Lana, how are you? Hi, great, thank you. Tell us a little about yourself. Uh, we've been dating for a year. Uh, yes. We met at a couple's game night. Did you? Enough. We yes. did. We were the only two who were not in couples. It was kind so. of a sabotage. They did it to set us up. Oh, yeah. I but, see. Uh, All right. I was an awful gamer. I, yes. I wasn't very good at the game, but I was able to win her over with my wit and charm. And his beard, right. also. All right. This entire million dollars, as of right now, is yours. OK? Right now, you've got a million dollars. I've got seven questions. Let's play the million dollar money drop. All right, Lon and Nathan, good luck. The two categories for question number one are cocktails, reality TV. Talk it over. I feel like I've, I've, I've been around cocktails enough to, to be confident I've in that. I've enough restaurants. Let's do Let's cocktails. Do you want to do cocktails? Yeah. yeah. OK. The four possible answers are A, Cosmopolitan, B, Bloody Mary, C, Tequila Sunrise, and D, Long Island Iced Tea. OK. Uh, and the question is? Long Island. According to the International Bartenders Association, a screwdriver has the same non-alcoholic ingredient as what other drink? Talk it over. Okay. Cosmopolitan has what? It's, uh, it's, it's uh, red. Okay, wait. A screwdriver is vodka and orange juice. So the orange juice is the non-alcoholic ingredient. OK. okay. Uh, uh, Cosmopolitan Lana... is red. And yes. It, it's got it's cranberry? It's cranberry, yes. So no. That's 60 seconds on no. the clock. It started. Bloody Mary, Bloody Mary is, like, is the uh, tomato juice. Tomato. And one million dollars to move around. It's not. There's no orange juice in a Bloody Mary. Are you sure? Yes, I'm sure. OK. Uh, uh, and then uh, Long Island iced tea is a mixture of like, like seven 45 no. seconds. Okay. Please start moving your money. Right, uh, are you, are you thinking it's a key on this? One Long million to move. No, There's a lot of ingredients in the Long Island. It could be. Uh, the 35 seconds. Uh, OK, quickly. Oh are you sure it's not Bloody Mary? I've never I, had I'm, one. I, I'm, yes. They're, it's like a tomato-y. Yeah. You put olives. You wouldn't put that in orange juice. Oh this my is, gosh, this is a lot of money. According okay. to the International Bartenders Association, <laughs> Screwdriver has the same non-alcoholic ingredient as what other drink? Orange juice. Orange juice. Tequila Sunrise yes. has what in it? It has orange. It's tequila it's, it's and orange juice. juice. Yes, yes. Orange. Is that it? I think so. Tequila, tequila orange juice and so. what else? What is else? I don't know. I don't know what's in it. I know there's orange juice in it. It's got uh, non-alcoholic ingredient. It's got a red. All right, it's it's orange juice. Okay. All right, you've put all your million dollars. Holy yes, we smokes. One answer. I'm pretty sure it's tequila and orange juice, yes. Now I have to offer. Would you like your quick change here on the first question? No, I'm sure. I'm sure. Can you stick with it? Yes. All right, mm -hmm. then. It's time to step up and see what drops. The entire million dollars is all riding on C, tequila, sunrise. happened any better. <laughs> All right, let's take a look at the two categories for question number two. Shrek on the road. Talk it over. Uh, I think we go Shrek. Okay, I Shrek. Got it. I got it. Yeah, Shrek. All right, they're going with Shrek. The four possible answers are A, the voice of Shrek. B, the voice of Donkey. C, the voice of Puss in Boots. Or D, the voice of the king. Okay. And the question is, which Shrek actor fathered a child with a Spice Girl? <laughs> Talk it over. All right. The voice of Shrek okay. is Michael Myers. Okay. The Donkey? voice of Donkey That's is Eddie, Eddie Murphy. Murphy. Wasn't okay. he with uh, yeah, one, yeah. Of the, one of them at one point? The voice of Puss, Puss in Boots. Puss in Boots. Is, who, it's Antonio Banderas. <laughs> who's the voice of the king? I don't know what the king is. 
60 seconds. Movie, 60 seconds on right, the so clock, it's, and it's, it's moving. Okay, it's Mike fun. Myers, okay. I, I'm 100% sure it yeah, wasn't Eddie Murphy was with the... 50 seconds. Move that okay, money, kids. I'm going to start putting some hands. It's a lot yeah, of okay. money. Okay. It's got to go somewhere. Um, which Shrek the actor the fathered a child with a spice figure that out before he put all the money was, But I know Eddie Murphy was dating um, was Melanie. Scary Wait, Spice. Mel one of the Melanies. Was scary Spice? two, right? Scary, yes. No. Uh, which yes. Shrek actor no. fathered a child no. with a spice scary. 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 Yes. What was the kid's name? Do you remember? I don't know. Who's 25 seconds. Uh, oh. Work as a team. Don't, don't break the game. Lana and Nathan working okay. as a team. 15 okay. seconds. Eddie Murphy. Eddie Murphy had a kid oh, with a Spice Girl. Oh, you're sure about that? Yes, Melanie. Who no. was the voice of the king? No. Oh, you're sure it's Eddie Murphy? Yes. 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 Okay. No. All right. All right. A, the voice of Shrek. Michael Myers. No money on that drop. B, the voice of Donkey. You put the entire million dollars. Yes. C, the voice of Puss in Boots, who you said is... Antonio Banderas. And you have to say it that way, right? Antonio Banderas. Antonio Banderas. <laughs> and D, the voice of the king, a total mystery, I and yet know. there's no money there either. It was John Cleese, wasn't it? I don't know. Doesn't matter now. It could matter now, because once again, I'm going to offer you the quick change opportunity. 30 extra seconds, one time only in the first six questions. John Is it Cleese now? did not father a child with a spice girl. <laughs> I know that much. OK, we're going to stick with it then. Yeah. You're going to stick with it? Yep. Yes. Let's step up and see what drops. It's $1 million, all on the voice of Donkey. If you're correct, we're moving on to question number three with the entire million. Good luck. Let's look at the two categories for question number three. Okay. Oh. Disco breakfast cereal. Talk it over. Uh, we definitely don't know disco. We gotta go breakfast cereal. We gotta go breakfast cereal. You're gonna go breakfast cereal? Yes. yes. All right. The four possible answers are A, rabbit's yeah, foot, yeah, B, clover, uh, C, yeah, horseshoe, oh, and D, heart. heart. Oh, wow. And heart. the question is. Which of these was never a Lucky Charms marshmallow shape? Talk it over. Okay. Uh, uh, what's that commercial? The clovers hurts. I'm pretty sure Lucky Charms has clovers. Yeah, Just, Lucky Charms. That yeah. would sound reasonable to me. Yep. Horseshoes is, is a Lucky Charm, and I sure? vividly remember 60 seconds uh, that they, they had horseshoes in them. Okay. Hearts. They're the definitely clock hearts. is moving. They're, they're I've never heard of a horseshoe one, but I, I don't know if I've ever eaten Lucky Work Charms. Work together. You've got right. 50 seconds uh, to move a million dollars. Have you, have you seen a rabbit's foot in it? I would think eating a rabbit's foot as a child would be traumatic. So, I agree. Uh, so what are we doing? It, which, which of these, which was, of these never, was never all right, are we putting it all a marshmallow? Are we sure? let's, okay. start, let's start here. Okay. I'm not, um, I, I, I've never seen 30 horseshoe. seconds. Half go, go, the go, go, time go, 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 go. is gone. Okay, All the money's sure? there. You've got to no, move it. Tell me about horseshoe. Are you 100% uh, sure? I'm thinking, do you know that heart is right? I, no. I Get thought the so. money where you, you want it. Like 20, 20 seconds, 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 guys. Wait, Come on put, now. I think we should split this one. I really don't know. You don't know horseshoe or what? I don't know. You're, I don't move know. money. Move money. we got 13 seconds. Where do I put it? I don't know. Where you Quickly, quickly, quickly. Can some of here? No, no, no. Baby. Little torn. The question is, which of these was never a Lucky Charms marshmallow shape? A, rabbit's foot. You felt that would be traumatic. For a, a traumatic child. experience for a child, a rabbit's foot. So you put $780,000 on rabbit's foot. B, clover. You've got nothing. C, horseshoe. There was a little debate. At one point, you said you vividly remember seeing a horseshoe. I've never seen a horseshoe one, but it makes sense being lucky, but then How, so does... You said it, it was vivid for you. 
as a child, I always wanted Lucky Charms, and my mother wouldn't let me have them. Oh, oh no. I had... Do you want to talk to Mom? She's on the camera there with the light over it. Mom, well, I just wanted sugar in my cereal. All right, good. Perfect. And 120000 on heart. How do you both feel about the heart? I, I feel like I've seen hearts in Lucky Charms commercials, but then it doesn't really go with the theme, so maybe I'm delusional. I don't know. You've got your quick change opportunity. I have to offer that up. Do it now? I, no. All uh, right, it's good. time. You're going to pass on the quick change? Pass yeah. the quick change. Yes. Then it's time to step up and see what drops. All right, folks. Terrified. Here's hoping you're correct. Good luck. $780,000. Four questions remain. You worked incredibly like a team. I refuse to believe you've only been together for a year. Tell me the truth. We really have only been together for a year, but wow. things happened that kind of brought us together quickly. I, I lost my dad, like, three months into our relationship. Oh, my. So, and um, oh, I'm I, sorry. That's OK. <laughs> it was, it, it created was, a bond between you? Yeah, it yeah. was really one of those things where I met her and I knew that I would do anything for her. And then going through that experience with her, it was just like, I was like, I will carry you through this if we have to. Let's, yeah. I'm not leaving. Well, we're here for you tonight. Yeah, he's, he's my rock. He's my very tall rock. <laughs> he's your very tall rock. Yes. <laughs> and together you've got $780,000. You've reached the fourth question. As you may have noticed, you've gotten rid of one of the drops. There are now only three, but the rules remain the same. You must continue to risk all of your money on every question, and you must continue to leave one drop clear, all right? You may have also noticed the question is getting a little more difficult. So what we're going to do now at question four is to add more time to the clock. You'll have 75 seconds, OK? Yep. You ready to move on? Yeah. All right. Let's take a look at the two categories for question number four. They are dogs and fast food. Talk it over. We've okay. eaten fast food like every day this week. Okay, we've eaten fast food. Okay. Fast food. All right. The three possible answers are A, lettuce, B, pickle slices, or C, tomato. And the question is, which of these ingredients is not on a McDonald's Big Mac? Talk it over. I've never had a Big Mac. What? I know. All right. Uh, <laughs> uh, all right. I feel like pickle slices is. OK. So I feel like it's either tomato or lettuce. Uh, What's the burger with the lettuce? 75 seconds. Start moving. Picture oh. the Big Mac, so Nathan. Nervous? Picture the Big Mac. Picture the Big Mac. When's the last time you ate one? Uh, I don't know what to do. It's been a long time. Tomato. I've been eating other things. Yeah, put some there. Um, tomato. What's 60 it? seconds it's, on the Big clock. Big Mac is, is, is sure it's, a, a it's a bun, it's a burger, it's a bun. There is lettuce. There is lettuce. Are you sure? Seriously. Which of these it's, ingredients it's is shredded not lettuce. on a McDonald's Big Mac? I believe Mac. it's shredded Which lettuce. Which one of these ingredients How is sure? not? I don't have any idea, idea. Okay. how okay. sure, okay. but. OK, well then, but pick, are you sure there's pickle? A lot of people don't like pickle. So maybe they wouldn't just automatically put it. is not. 30 seconds. 30 seconds. Uh, a lot of money to move. Keep moving it. I feel like tomato is the answer. Tomato? I, I'll put one more thing. Yes. Okay. I don't remember seeing anything red on a Big Mac or that was supposed to be there. Okay. Um, what? Uh, what does that mean? Right, so wait, wait, I got 17 seconds. Lettuce. Uh, we got 180 there. Which um, is not. Which is not. Wait. Nine. Nine. Which is not. Pickle is not? Pickle is not. No, no way, you're right. No, put it back, put it back. All right, time's up. Which Let's talk it over. Let me help you focus. Please. Which yeah. of these ingredients not. is not on a McDonald's Big Mac? You've got 
200,000 on A, lettuce. Yes. B, pickle slices, you've got no money. And then tomato C, 580,000 on that drop. You have a chance at that quick change. Tomatoes no, is not. I think we should leave it. I think we're right. All right. Okay. Yep. We're You're saying leave it. We're not going to use the quick change. Then it's time to step up and see what drops. <laughs> All right. Which of these ingredients is not on a McDonald's Big Mac? Good luck. Could he use your quick change? Uh. Are you sorry he didn't use it? Yes. <laughs> Lana? Hopefully we'll need it later because this is right. It has to be tomato. Or it's over. Lana? Yeah. Nathan? Yes. Ready? Yes. Yeah, oh, Hold each it. other. <laughs> I love you. For a little longer because we're going to take a break. We'll be right back with the million dollar money drop. You've got $580,000 here on question four. Over half a million dollars. Let's repeat the question. Which of these ingredients is not on a McDonald's Big Mac? You've got 580,000 saying the tomato is not on a Big Mac. Sliced pickles are. Oh, God. It's time to step up and see what drops. Good luck. Uh. Are they going on? 580,000, or are they going home? Congratulations. $580,000. Three questions remain. Over half a million dollars. Okay. Three okay. questions We're up. We're half millionaires. You've got your quick change intact. That's great. Let's take a look at the categories for question number five. Board games. U.S. geography. We started many games. Started playing games. I'm pretty good at geography, though. OK. okay. Geography. geography. Geography? They're going to go with U.S. geography. The three possible answers are A, four, or B, five, and C, six. And the question is, how many U.S. states touch the Pacific Ocean? Talk it over. U.S. states. There's Hawaii, there's Alaska, there's Oregon, there's Washington, and there's California. Are you sure that's, that's it? Uh, Wait. 75 seconds. Uh, it's not four. So, okay. Hawaii, count them. Hawaii, Alaska, Washington, Washington Oregon, Oregon, California. California. Is there something in between? No. Unless we took over Mexico recently. <laughs> um, 60 seconds. Right. Let's, it's, it's five, right? I counted that, yes. right? The clock Hawaii, is moving. Start moving Hawaii, money. Hawaii, Alaska. Hawaii, Alaska, Washington, Washington Oregon, Oregon, California. California. Are we missing anything in there? 45 seconds. Move them, move them, move them, move them. Should we put, we should put some just to be safe? No. no. Are you sure? Yes. Baby, this is How many U.S. states touched money. the Pacific Hawaii, Ocean? Hawaii, Alaska, oh, Washington, Oregon, California. Th okay. Name another state 30 that's on seconds. the Pacific Ocean. I don't know, I'm just, I'm panicked right now because my adrenaline is rushing. I feel How like many U.S. states touched the Pacific on... Ocean? How Wait. many U.S. states touched the Pacific Ocean? What if it's, it's like not... 20 seconds, guys. It's not four. It's not four. And it's... I can't think of another state that's touching it. It's got to be five. Oh. Okay. Hawaii, you Alaska. You want to put like a little bit. No. Five, eight, I feel like this is right, right? Eight, Can you I think, think so. of anything else? I can't think of anything else. That's it. It's five. Okay. Five, okay. All right. Nathan. Yes. You counted down the states earlier. You counted five. You've got your quick change opportunity. I have to offer that up. No, we're done. We're good. Let's step up and see what drops. <laughs> we got the 
this one, baby. How many U.S. states touch the Pacific Ocean? If it's five, there are two questions standing between them and over half a million dollars. Two questions remain. These questions are getting harder. Because of that, we're going to give you a little more time. You'll now have 90 seconds on the clock. Uh -huh. Okay? Ready for six? Yes. yes. All right, the two categories for question six are ad icons and YouTube. I watch a lot of YouTube. You know more about YouTube than I do, so you got to carry me here if they were going there. Well, okay. YouTube. You seem very confident. <laughs> I took geography, she's taking YouTube. Okay, this <laughs> one's on Lana. YouTube is the category. The three possible answers. A, Justin Bieber. Justin Bieber. B, Rihanna. C, Lady, Lady Gaga. Gaga. All right, it's gotta be like most views or something. Yeah, and it was the most popular video. The question is, which music artist was the first to be viewed one billion times on YouTube. Talk it over. Billion, Billion times. times on YouTube. Okay, well, Justin uh, Bieber started on YouTube. So I don't know, does that count? Like, all, yeah, all his old stuff before he even became famous. Who was the first to one billion famous? views? Uh, one of them was the first so we, to one billion views. The first to one billion views on YouTube. 90 like, seconds, like go. Gaga I feel like has, I read like, more something stuff. about Lady... Yeah, but Justin Bieber was discovered on YouTube, so you got to count all his old... I don't know how many he posted before he was... All right, so that. what we're saying is... It, it, Rihanna, do you I know anything about her on YouTube? 75 seconds. Yeah, you feel like, it, her, you feel like I, you've I heard something uh, about Justin or like Lady Gaga had, being on YouTube? I know her telephone video was crazy viewed many, many times. I'm going to start putting money okay, over I'm, here. I'm Gaga. 60 start seconds. money over there. All right. Uh, uh, 580,000. Really longer than Gaga. Are we splitting Bieber, this halfway, or do you feel like it's Gaga? Uh... 50 seconds. 50 seconds. I... Which was she's the had first like more, one billion? Yeah, I feel like I she's know, had she's, hit more well, hit she videos. Has those, she has those, like, music videos that, that are... Right now like we got 220 Michael on that. Jackson style, where they're really long and they're like full-on little right, movies. Well, 36 seconds. Maybe. We gotta leave okay, one wait, drop clear. But remember, Coming down to 30 so seconds. Are, are we eliminating Rihanna? I know that, I think his baby video is like the number one most viewed, let's but just, I don't know let's which Let's split is, it halfway. Let's split it. I, I, 25 okay. seconds. 280. Whatever amount you have left, right? What do you want? Amount you'll have a chance to take home. Okay. Where do you want this? If you're correct, I feel. I, we, That's we were a loaded saying, question. <laughs> I feel like uh, Rihanna's not one billion. I, yeah, 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 I don't think so. Be the first hey. artist to be Seven, one billion. Six. Gaga, go Gaga. Gaga. I think Gaga. All right. All right. Justin Bieber. Very popular. Lady Gaga, very popular. At least we forget Rihanna. But you chose to take Rihanna out of the equation. You made it to question six. You chose not to use your quick change until now. But it's yours if you want it. I think I'm going to have a heart attack if we do that. <laughs> okay. um, you don't want the quick change? No. No. Nope. No. We're golden. Let's step up and see what drops. Here, you see. Good luck. Okay. Go away, Rihanna. Go away. $300,000 into the final question and a chance to take it all home. Do
money drop. Question number seven. Yeah. <laughs> this is the one that allows you to take money home. Oh, please. You started with a million dollars six questions ago. Together, you've gotten to the final question here at a chance at $300,000. Yeah. Now, here's where things got a little interesting. No one has ever made it to question seven with $300,000. That has never happened. <laughs> now we've reached the all or nothing point in the game. As you've noticed, we've taken away one of the drops. There are now only two. However, the game remains the same. The rules the same. You must risk all of your money and you must leave one drop clear. It's all or nothing. You choose correctly, you go home with $300,000. Yeah. Yeah. I have one more piece of tremendous news. There'll be no more pressure of an annoying clock. You've got all the time you need. How you feeling? Uh, like I've been put in a blender. You good. <laughs> Are you ready? Yes. The two categories for question seven. Driving. College. Talk it over. Oh. We both went to college. Okay. I don't drive well. <laughs> My instinct is driving. I feel like we're gonna go with, with driving. Okay, driving it is. The two possible answers are A, men. Oh God. B, women. No! no! And the question is, according to a 2007-2008 study by the auto insurance consulting company QPC, who receives more speeding tickets? Okay. All right. Young men who just got their licenses always speed. Their insurance is always higher. Yeah. I know from experience that their insurance is higher, so I feel like speeding tickets will play a big part in yeah. that. I Women feel like have that. Women stigma. have the multitasking stigma where they're not paying attention to necessarily how fast they're driving. They're paying attention to who they're talking to on their Blackberry and putting on their makeup and all that kind of stuff. I love you. Uh, <laughs> I mean, there's a primal urge in men for speed. speed. And I feel like a lot of times women get out of tickets. That's true. <laughs> have you ever gotten out of a ticket? Yeah. All right. I feel like. Okay, wait, women multi My gut reaction is men. This my is... gut reaction is also men, but it's $300,000. So. <laughs> All right. <laughs> but wait, what about like uh, hormones and things that we women have? Maybe we're like really angry or emotional, and so we need to get where we're going. I don't know. We've been right on all of our gut instincts up till now. Yeah, it's men. Are we good? We are good. Are you good? We're good. We're good. We're, we're good. good. All right. <laughs> it's gotta be men. It's gotta be men. It's gotta be men. It's the final question. You've got three hundred thousand dollars and it's the all or nothing moment of the game. What we'd like to do at this point is to offer you one final fact regarding this question. Okay. Please understand, this fact is not meant to change your mind. Yeah. It will simply give you the opportunity to do so if you choose. Okay. I'm gonna give you the fact, and then we're gonna give you 60 seconds to talk it over. Okay. Are you ready for the final fact? Yes. Yes. The correct answer also receives more tickets for reckless driving and seatbelt violations. It's gotta be men. It's gotta be men. It's gotta be men. I always wear my seatbelt. I've gotten Even reckless driving park. ticket and I've gotten a seatbelt violation. <laughs> Nathan, you did not. You did not. I did. I was pulling out of a McDonald's and I got pulled McDonald's over. McDonald's gets us again. I swear to you that's what happened. I was pulled over for driving the wrong way on a one-way street. It's all or nothing. The but clock I... is moving. Oh, I didn't get a ticket, though, so I You've think You've got 45 seconds. We 
focus. Right. Reckless it's driving. It's men. It's, it's gotta, gotta be men. Be men. And, and in seatbelts, it's gotta be men. It's gotta be. It's just that machismo thing. Yeah, you think you don't need it because you're so tough. But you 30 do. seconds. <laughs> yeah, we, I agree. You gotta be it's, right. It's men. We're staying. It has to be men. We're staying do you the want course. us to stop the clock? Stop the clock. Yes. I want my money. Can they stop the drop? All right, let's step up and see what drops. Is $300,000 about to drop? Or is a trap door going to open and nothing drops? We're good. Give us one kiss for good luck. Let's do it. Okay. Come on. I'm ready. <laughs> Are you ready? We're yes. ready. You're going home with nothing, or you're going home our first winners of $300,000. Which is it going to be? Please. Oh, God. <laughs> I love you so much. If you're incorrect, then we'll go home with nothing. Okay. okay. If you're correct, you're the biggest winner this show has ever had. 